your character went through a lot last season. He learned a lot. But as that trailer indicated, uh, he might not be ready for what he's about to face. What can you say about this new threat of Darth Vader? I don't know if anyone would be ready for the threat of arguably the strongest, toughest, biggest villain in all of the galaxy. You know what I mean? And I mean, the whole Rebel crew as one, I don't know if they're strong enough for Darth Vader. But they're going to have to evade, but also keep growing the rebellion and growing... Um, in, in strength and numbers, but also pushing forward against the Empire with this threat looming. But, I mean, the Inquisitor was a huge threat alone, and we, somehow we were able to get past that. But, yeah, there's a lot to come and a lot in store, and the fact that, the fact that they even called in the forces of Darth Vader show how big the Rebellion has gotten and how it's taken seriously, which I think is pretty cool. You know, with Ahsoka around, it you know occurs to me, look, this is another person that could teach your character something, because there's not a lot of sources for Jedi knowledge. Exactly. So what is, is he going to her and saying, can you tell me some things that maybe Kanan doesn't know? Uh, I can't spill that much, yeah. but, I mean, Kanan, Kanan understands that he can teach Ezra, Ezra so much. Yeah. And he is not uh, opposed to bringing in other resources and, and helping to grow, because he wants Ezra to be the strongest Jedi possible. Um, so yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be far-fetched to have Ahsoka teach him a few things or be able to level with him, do you know what I mean? Because she she can probably relate with him a little as well, yeah. um, which I th makes for a cool dynamic, and we'll see if that ends up happening. But there's definitely more of Ahsoka in Season 2. Uh, you know, uh, can you talk a bit about uh, bringing in Captain Rex? Because while well, obviously they were saying how Kanan might not have such uh, fond feelings towards him because of the history... But this, you know, your character wouldn't have this knowledge, so does he think, oh, maybe this is another mentor of some sort? Ezra is not familiar with Captain Rex. He has no idea who he is, and and he recognizes that Kanan is so uh, opposed to them coming and helping out and does not trust them, and rightfully so for what he was put through. But Ezra is the one who we see uh, at the end of season one, he's now calling a few shots. He... he uh, He's more reputable in the group. Everyone understands, like, he has a reason to be here and can help us out. So um, he helps bridge the gap a little with Captain Rex coming into the crew and helping out. And, and he helps build up that trust between the two, which is uh, some exciting stuff. 